Hey everyone, in this video, we'll be installing GitHub Copilot into NeoVim with Astro and Vim configuration using Lazy.Vim Package Manager. Let's get started. First, let's open NeoVim and enter a test project folder containing an app.js file. We'll use this file to showcase how Copilot auto-completes code for us later. As you can see it works quite well. Now, close the file and reopen NeoVim. We'll test the copilot panel and copilot set commands, but keep in mind that they won't work without being inside a file. Open the app.js file again and run the copilot setup command. In my case, it's already set up and I'm logged in. But for new users, you'll be redirected to log in with your GitHub account. Now, let's explore some useful Copilot commands. Copilot enable, re-enable GitHub Copilot after disabling it. Copilot disable, globally disable GitHub Copilot inline suggestions. Copilot panel, open a window with up to 10 completions for the current buffer. Press CR to accept a solution. Head over to the GitHub Copilot NeoVim repository and clone it to your local machine. In my case, it's already installed. Navigate to your config slash vim folder. Inside, config slash and vim slash lua slash, create a new folder called plugins if it doesn't already exist. Then, create a new file named copilot.lua inside the plugins folder and paste the code provided by the GitHub Copilot NeoVim repository. Finally, open NeoVim and run the following commands to update your lazy.vim package manager. Lazy check in. Lazy sync. That's it. You've successfully installed GitHub Copilot and NeoVim using Astro and Vim and Lazy.Vim. Enjoy using Copilot to boost your productivity and write code faster. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more programming tutorials. Thanks for watching.